Hey guys, so a very interesting change. This is the regrade brazier. You can see it has a big giant rock, like mineral-like rock. And this is where you can get some sun points and moon points. It looks like this in the coin purse. You get these out of the coin purses, the prints and higher coin purses. And the big change is that this is now the only way to get burning logs. So as you can read the description right there, it says you can destroy the brazier without searching it to obtain a burning log. I personally have not planted one up in Aurora and acquired a burning log. But there have been a lot of people reporting this, and it has also been confirmed by Tryon Worlds that you can no longer just get burning logs by mining the trees up here in Aurora. Up here in this region... And this region over here, the Calmlands, you'll see this, this is a forest right here, and that's a burning forest. That's where you used to get burning logs. Now, to my understanding, please correct me if I am wrong on this, you get a burning trade pack from them, and you take that to this regrade brazier. As you can see right down here, it says use the smoking, uh, smoldering log to start the heating process. So you go ahead and you chop one down. You get a trade pack, and now you have to haul it over and put it on this and start the fire of this regrade brazier. After eight hours is done, the regrade brazier either can be examined for sun point, moon point fragments, or if you're really lucky, sun point, moon points. Or you can actually just not examine it and break it down into a burning log. Again, I do not know how many burning logs this procedure gives you. But yeah, that is the new and only way to get burning logs right now. So it's not that big of a deal because there aren't too many things that actually require burning logs. And it's actually called flaming log. So they probably want to change that, the tooltip there. The flaming log is only used for high-end components like siege tanks, farm wagons, racing cars. You need five of them for those. You also need them for the high-end gliders, but there's really no purpose to have these because they've all been norm normalized and nerfed. But if you do want to create one of those, it does cost five burning logs to create the glider thruster. The other thing that could actually be a problem is that it is required for siege ammo. You need two burning logs, or flaming logs, excuse me, to make 100 siege ammo. So the supply of the, burning, of the flaming logs might be uh, pretty great right now, but over time, if people do not plant these regrade brazers, the price of these flaming logs may jump up uh, dramatically uh, as people keep using siege ammo. I am not 100% certain if the siege ammo is used for ships. If it is used for ships, then that's going to be a very, very um, you know, in-demand item because naval combat is going to become more of a thing now. It says it's used for tree birchets and steam tanks. So to me, that sounds like land vehicles. Uh, but again, I do not know personally. So please let us know down in the comment section. This is a huge, huge change. And I would like to know more information about this. So if you guys can help us out here, please post comments about this. Uh, burning log prices or flaming log prices will probably be increasing. Um, it's probably a great thing to buy up a couple right now or go harvest a couple. You have one day left. The patch comes out tomorrow. So you can go get these flaming logs up in Aurora right now. And it's probably going to be worth a decent amount of money come in a couple days or a week or two. So I do recommend going to get some flaming logs.